two. Day number two for Jacob's birthday. Birthday and bash. We never showed you guys, but we upgraded. Woohoo! So with this, because we went from the blue, what was it called? Just preferred pass? I think so. Or something? I don't know. We had the blue, the light blue one, the two park pass. So now we get express after four. We get um, free. Um, Premier or preferred parking. Preferred, but it's not called preferred here, is it? Yeah, it is. Preferred parking, and we get we can upgrade to free valet, but then you know you have to tip, so it's not really free. Um, we also get 15% off at restaurants and shops. Mm -hmm. We get one free horror night ticket, and I think that's all the di different. Well, obviously you get to go into Volcano Bay with the three parks. Yeah. Um, I think that's all the difference. I think so too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we, it's 11 o'clock right now, and we are going to head to Cowfish for lunch for Jacob's birthday. So I'll show you guys that because we've never been there before. Jacob's excited. Give him some sushi. So as we're coming around here, I would like to say that on Thursday, Universal is supposed to make a huge announcement. And it is rumored to be a fantastic world theme park. Oh, is that what it's supposed to be? Like, the name of the theme park would be, like, Fantastic World. Did they announce that one time ago? That they were no, because they, they never announced that it's officially they're having a fourth park. Well, not officially. No. But I think people have It's been rumored for a long, for a long time. time. Yeah, but on Thursday at the convention center, at 10 a.m., they are announcing it. And I'm ex very excited. They're, I mean, they kind of gave it away already. They kind of were like, oh, we're going to make it a seven-day destination. Like, yeah. it has to be another park. They've already announced, like, they've just built resorts, so it's not a new resort. Yeah. And it's not a new ride, so. Yeah. I don't know what else it would be. And we will be making our first Volcano Bay vlog on Sunday. Next week, Sunday, with Alyssa and Mitch. We're excited. We were supposed to go today. Well, we probably could have gone today because it's hotter than expected, but but it was supposed to it's supposed to rain later on today, so we decided to go next weekend. So see, so yeah. So we just like turned towards the parking, and it's like full. Like there's all these people here, and it's 11 o'clock. Like aren't people shouldn't they already be here? It wasn't even this full when we came opening day for Hank. No. Six a.m. Yeah, like what is this? I don't know. So weird. It is weird. I've never... Yeah. It's prime parking, that's what it is. It's not preferred. Or prime parking. Because I knew it wasn't the same as Disney. I didn't know if it was, it's like prime or premiere or... I know, because our passes are premiere. But what's preferred? What's preferred? We, weren't we, preferred is Disney's parking. But, but we also had the preferred pass. Did we before. have the preferred pass? There's too many like... Yeah, too know. many P's. <laughs> See, we would normally have to pay $40 for prime, but it's free with our passes. So that's a good value. Or we also have for valet because we. I'm pretty sure we can just upgrade for to valet for free, if I believe. I don't know. That's insane. That is insane. What? So hours are till both parks are up until ten tonight. Volcano Bay is open till nine. They raise the general parking by a dollar. Yeah. Why is it twenty six? That's such a pain. Why isn't it just twenty five? That's know. so weird. Have some... There's like a water drop right on the window. Oh, it's your crack. It's like a windshield <laughs> crack. <laughs> it's like blocking everything. Sorry. Alrighty. We're at Cowfish. Are you excited? Well, I'm starving too. So yeah, I know. He's been wanting to eat here forever. I have. Yeah. It's calling out to me. Yeah, it is. Hi. Build a fish. What? Build a fish! Oh, there you go. Oh, there we go. Oh, look at all the fishies you can make. Which one do we want? A cute one. The white one? No. I don't know if it's The cute. little green. This one? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe I'm supposed to drag it. Oh, there we go. Oh! Oh, geez. oh. <laughs> Ooh, let's put some clothes on him. This, this is so strange. Give him a little bow tie. Yeah. But I don't want to, like, oh, you put it on his eye. Oh. Well, I don't know. 
Put it on his forehead. I can't grab it now. Oh, oh gosh. Right there. Oh, it doesn't it's go there. Just to his face. Oh, come on. There. There, there we go. go. Oh, now it looks weird. It's like it does look weird. Oh, there we go. Oh, there. Look at him. <laughs> <laughs> there, we gotta make it more like 3D. Random. Paintbrush. Oh, but no. Is it dynamite? That's what it looks like. No, it's a sushi bowl. It's a bowl. God. Oh, what's that? I don't know. It looks like dynamite. <laughs> Facial items. Some glasses. Ooh. Tim Tracker. <laughs> but it's like up on his forehead though. <laughs> I love the, the wood. Beautiful. How's your fish going? Oh, interesting. It's the only thing that like actually works on this place. <laughs> okay, let's go in. Let's see fish building. Let's take a look see at the menu, shall we? Why are you showing the place first? Okay, well, let's <laughs> show you the place first. So we're right next to the bar. So there's like screens. You can see it. There's like screens in the table or in the bar. Counters. The TV screens in the bar. Right there. Yeah. And they have like, they're like in a fish tank. I love how there's like cows up there. Oh yeah, and then there's cows <laughs> up there running through the sky. It is small. Once it's it is outdoor seating. Which I would have to say, if you're outside seating, you have a beautiful view. Because like, if yeah. you can see the castle, like, if you're outside, that's beautiful. You can see the castle right there. Yeah, you can see everything from here. Yeah. You get a good view. So here's a look at the menu. This crab rangoon dip sounds excellent. I'm not going to get it, but it sounds good. Because I don't eat crab. You don't eat crab. You don't I'm eat anything out of Chinese. My house. But but it sounded good. So here's the appetizers. Oh, they have Parmesan bacon truffle fries. Those sound pretty good. Salads. And here's the sushi. And here's the sushi rolls. So these are smaller. She said eight those were eight. Yeah, eight, and these are all nine. And these are all nine. These are entree size. So she gave a suggestion, said that the Tropical Storm one was one of her favorites, and the OMG roll is one of her favorites. And the Free Spirit. And the Free Spirit, she said, is new. She hasn't tried it, but she said that that's most people's favorite. And then combos. And then here are all the burgers, which is probably what you'll get. You're not going to get sushi. No. So those are those. For Gucci. I didn't know they had milkshakes. They do have milkshakes. They do. So this is like a burger inside of sushi. How does that even work? There's only one that actually has fish. So. There's only one that has fish? There's only one that actually has fish in it, I think. Of these. Yeah. I forgot which one she said it was. Oh, the bottom one, the tuna one. I don't even know how that works. Oh wait, that's not a roll, that's a sandwich. I don't know. I forgot, she said a lot, I forgot. Oh yeah, here are all the milkshakes. Those look good. They do, the marshmallow crisp good. ones sound good. Shocking. <laughs> Am I on? You on. I got the tempura roll, which is like one of the smaller ones. And then I got the tropical storm one, which is one that she suggested. Yes. See how it is. Yeah, apparently it's like Florida in a sushi roll. It's Florida, yeah. That's how she described it. Yeah. I just got a cheeseburger. Basically. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We without got, the like, bacon. A, a bacon burger without the bacon. Yep, that's what so, I got. Yeah. <laughs> Jacob's birthday meal has arrived. So this is the tropical storm. 
There's different flavors for I forgot which. I totally I don't remember. To. But uh, yeah. like the green ones are one flavor and the yellow is one and then the black and the red. But I don't remember. I didn't it was like one was citrusy, one was Yeah, something. like the yellow one is citrusy and then like I have no I don't, idea. I really don't remember. And then what and is then this? And this one? is the temporal one. This is just like very basic sushi. Gotcha. And it has little shrimps there. Gotcha. Well, I hope you like it. On sure. This is mine. <laughs> yeah, you do. It's not pretty either, right? You should just eat all at one bite. <laughs> How was it? Was it like ranked on your sushi list? Is that one of your best? I don't know. I have to try this one. Now. Okay. Oh, it's a little slippery. Uh, I can't <laughs> grab it. It's sticking to the plate. You got there it. There you go. This is gonna be really hard. You got it. Uh -oh. oh no. Oh no. Oh no, that one just totally fell apart. I need apart. a new piece. This is really hard. Just shove it. Just put it in your mouth. I can't. Oh. <laughs> it was fruity. Fruity? Like fruity? Pineapple. You're allergic to pineapple. I'm not like that allergic. Oh my gosh. I haven't really said much about my burger. My burger was good. It was very hard to eat though because it's so greasy and like saucy. So it's one of those where the bottom bun gets like soggy, you know? So yeah, but it was overall, it was good. Jacob, how is yours? Delicious. Yeah. Which one do you like more? Probably the more expensive one. No, I like them both, really. I mean, do you? That one's easier to eat. Yeah, he's been having to eat this one in like different parts. Yeah. But you can taste the difference between the different ones. I don't know which one's which. Yeah. One of them tastes like pineapple. But it's good. Good. Very good. Good. Alright, she's trying her first real sushi. Let's see if you like it. I don't have anything to drink. I need to drink some of your coke. Okay. It's not... Come on, just try it. Let's do it. Do it. That's way too big of a bite. You can do it. Here, have some coke. Have some coke. Okay, it's not that bad. <laughs> okay, so you won't be having any sushi when we go to Tokyo. Ew. Alright, we're heading out of Cowfish. Jacob did say it's his new favorite restaurant at City Walk. It's delicious. <laughs> I'm still a big fire girl. But I want to say that I don't think they're like known for one thing. Like they're not known for like You're like a black face. <laughs> there like, you are, there's your face. <laughs> or known for like their burgers. So I think both are equally great. They're very good. They're very good. Yes, I agree with you. Yeah. So we'll be back sometimes when Jacob wants to. For any special occasion Jacob wants to come here, he can. And it really wasn't that pricey. We thought it was going to be way more, and it wasn't. The total for us was 47 And I was most of that. Yeah, he got two rolls, and I just had a burger. Two sodas for 47 Not bad. Pretty good. Off to the Pox. All right. We spent some time at studios, but we, um, we'll head over to Islands. We don't really have a plan. No. Nope. We're just gonna. Tonight is going with the wait times today. Oh, yeah. 
Yeah, we were gonna ride Men in Black and it was like 45 minutes. And we have one hour till we have Express, so we're just trying to like kill time before we can use Express. <laughs> yeah. Let's see if we can get on today, but I don't know. We'll see. Well, right now we're in the train station. So, yeah. Here comes the train backwards. I just don't know why they did it that way. So my idea was, like, just make the train a little longer and then just make it double-sided. Yeah. So when it comes in, you can't see that end. That's what like they the should back. do. And then the same the other way. Yeah. Because this is like the worst. Like, no train comes in backwards. <laughs> if you cut it off far enough back, you can't see that it's double-sided. It just looks like the train keeps going. No, you're right. That's the way I would. But, yeah. Okay, what do I know? Yeah. Like it looks cool if you're coming from the other way. Yes. This way is weird because it looks like We typically take the train though from this, from studios to islands. We rarely go from islands to studios. Right. Made it to Hogsmeade. We're trying to decide if you should jump in line or not. For Hagrid's. Yes. I love it. I feel like I love it way more than Jacob does. Jacob likes it. I like it. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so we'll try for round number four on good old Hagrid's. I like it. I just don't know if I like it. You know, I have to dedicate half of my day to you. Okay, it's not half your day. Well, we stood in line for half the day already. Yes, I know. <laughs> We're going to go see if the line's sticking out because we know how the line is. So we're going to see how much is sticking out outside. Yeah. Unfortunately, I'm not hearing any motorbikes go by, which is not a good sign. Shocker. Brief delay. Just like any other time. So the reason why they always have brief delays is because they open the ride four months early. Should have never done that. No. And it causes chaos over here. Yeah, it does. Everyone comes over here, but then they don't know where to go. Yes. Luckily, when it works, Universal has their uh, thing on their app. There, where you can set a reminder or set an alert when a ride gets to a certain time limit. So it's nice when it works, because then we can see when it goes back, and instead of keep coming back and checking, you know? Yeah, but I said it today and it didn't tell me. Anything. Yeah. <laughs> so. Yeah, so, not sure what the new plan is, but we're going to just go keep checking. Okay, so we're just sitting in Leaky Cauldron. No, nope, that's sticks. not where we are. We're at Three Broomsticks. Um, Hagrid's has officially closed for the night. Good job, Universal. Um, so Jacob and I are sitting here, and we are discussing the big announcement on Thursday. And he's, Jacob told me there were three main speculations. Yeah. Well, one is Nintendo. Boo! The people have been speculating that for years, because they did that already in Tokyo, right? They're doing that in Tokyo one. Didn't they build that already? Start building that somewhere? That's what they did. That's what this said. Oh. But anyway. Don't know. It would be that or what else did I say? Fantastic Beasts. Oh, yeah. That, that doesn't expansion. make sense. Like an expansion of Harry Potter. But that doesn't make sense. Like you're going to make a whole park for the Harry Potter? That makes zero sense. I don't know. I'm just telling you what the internet I'm going to go with that one's like a 0% chance. Yeah. Or it'll be DreamWorks. Bum, bum, bum. Yeah. So like, How to Train Your Dragon, basically. Yeah. Is what we're hoping for. That's what I'm hoping for. They could easily do a park with like different lands, because they would have, they have, um, How to Train Your Dragon. They have um, Shrek. They have Kung Fu Panda. Or they could just. Is is Secret Life? No, that's Illumina, or Luma, whatever. It's the same people that did... Disney, yeah. Okay, so we tried for ride number four. Biggest fail. They evacuated the ride. There's people, uh, there's certain people now 
there's like cat oh, team members walking through the track. So basically the huge. No, yeah, the huge. <laughs> Never ever works. So we're gonna just probably hang out for a little bit, try to use our express passes, and try to finish out the night better than right now. I kind of want to know the ratio of time that it's running and like not running. I agree, yeah. I feel like it's way more fun. Yeah. I bet, no, I bet you it's, it's more, it's broken more than it runs. Probably. Yeah. Do you want to do for better? Uh, sure. Okay. Alright, hey guys, sorry about that choppy video in the end. Um, Universal was very busy, much busier than we expected. Um, all of the um, express lines were like beyond long. Like, we, I could tell during the day because before 4 I could just tell the express lines were long. And I knew at 4 when all the um, orange passes could go to express, I knew it was going to be a nightmare. So, sorry that was kind of jumpy. Um, still excited for the Thursday announcement for Universal. We'll keep you updated on that. Um, we have a bunch of new footage coming up. We're super excited. We have a bunch of like major events coming up. Um, so yeah, we have a very good August coming up. A lot of good films. Sorry about this choppy video, but I hope you enjoyed our cowfish review and we'll see you soon.